Finding a match for Robert. That is the mission a Grayson County family is on for a 21-year-old in desperate need of a kidney. 10 News reporter Jessica Jewell shows us the unique way his friends and family are trying to find a donor and the message they're spreading all around the world. Two years ago, Robert Fallon was a recent high school graduate with his whole life ahead of him. Then one day, he went to the doctor thinking he had bronchitis, and everything changed. He said, Mom, they said that I'm in end-stage renal failure. And I was like, nah, this ain't real. This isn't happening. His kidney function was down to just 12%. His only option, start dialysis and wait for a transplant. Doctors telling his mother Janet. It's typically three to five years for wait for deceased kidney match. Good luck keeping your son alive that long. He's now down to less than 1% kidney function, going to dialysis three times a week. Unfortunately, everybody thinks, oh, well, he's on dialysis. He'll be here for another 15, 20, 30 years. That's not the case with me because without a kidney, I will not make it. A frightening realization for his girlfriend, Crystal Sparks, who decided to use her talents for change. I kept seeing these painted rocks everywhere, and then when he got diagnosed, I was trying to think of a way. I was just like, well, how can we, you know, locate a potential donor? And then it sort of just clicked. Crystal started painting rocks. It's a very inexpensive way to make an impact. Each with its own unique design, but the same message on the back, trying to find a match for Robert. They're now popping up all around the world. And over the past two years, dozens of people have reached out. Please just let this be the one. But so far, no match. He deserves a chance at life just like the rest of us. Each rock, another attempt to give him that chance. It would save my son's life. They'd essentially be my hero, like you saved my life. And I can never thank you or repay you for that. To give a young man much more than a kidney, but a future. In Grayson County, Jessica Jewell, 10 News, working for you. And to find out how you can help Robert and others by becoming an organ donor, you can head to our website, WSLS.com.